Hi, welcome to Coaster Mania. I'm Micah, and today I'm going to quickly review Oaks Amusement Park. Similar to my last video, since Oaks Park is as small as it is, I felt like it wouldn't make so much sense to do a full-on review of this park. This park is over 100 years old and has cemented itself as a historical landmark of the Portland, Oregon area. So let's get started. Since this is still a new format for me, I'll go ahead and reintroduce it to you. Rather than discuss 10 different parts about the park and rank them individually, I'm going to talk about what the park does right and what it might need improvement on. Also, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe since we have a lot of great content coming up in the next year. So, what does Oaks Park do right? Well, first off, their use of space is quite good. There's a large variety of rides here, and they're all fairly well dispersed, with some clear indicators of thrill level. For instance, towards the southern end of the park, where Adrenaline Peak sits, the rides are a bit larger scale and more on the thrilling side. On the north end of the park is where the smaller scale rides sit, and are able to provide tiny thrills to younger riders. Let's not forget, Oaks Park sits on only 44 acres of land, but still manages to pack in 24 rides, along with a mini golf course, a roller rink, and a large pavilion area. One other cool thing about Oaks Park is its entry policy. Rather than being pay for entry, there are no fences around the park, meaning that it's only pay to ride. This means that during the off season, locals are able to walk in and around the park with no issue. So far, the only other park that I know about that does this is Knobles in Pennsylvania. The ride collection is another strong suit of this park. From the compact thrills of Adrenaline Peak to the awesome hang time filled experience of Atmosphere, Oaks Park has something for just about anyone. There is a lot of care put into this park and I can't wait to see what things will look like in the future. Oaks Park is a place that is doing their absolute best with what they have, and I commend them for that. There are only a few minor areas where I could see this place really improving, and I'm going to dive into that now. The biggest thing I see possibly being improved with this park is the food offerings. There's a couple of small food shops that offer basic food choices like pizza and hamburgers, which is fine, but just a little bit more variety on that front would be great in my opinion. This next suggestion is only something small, but it would be awesome to see one more coaster at this park on the smaller scale, possibly something like a Vacoma Family Boomerang, which are becoming very popular nationwide. One other thing that could be improved in my opinion is the front entry area. I know that this park used to be a bit more decorated around the front, and a lot of that has sadly come down over time. I would love to see just a bit more in the way of facades or decorations around the park to liven it up just a little. Ultimately, there isn't a whole lot that I would change, since I know that realistically, there isn't a whole lot that can be changed. Wrapping it all up, Oaks Park is a charming old park in the middle of Portland that does a lot with just a little. It has a lot of rides in a little space. It offers a variety of things to do with only a small sized park budget. It would be interesting to see what this park would do with some larger investment over time, but ultimately, if things stay the way they are, I won't be complaining. This park is a staple to the Portland area and really deserves more support from the locals in my opinion. Overall, I'd rate Oaks Park a 7.5 out of 10. A good place, and if you're in the area, I'd highly recommend stopping by. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to leave a like and comment below and hit that bell icon to be notified of our upcoming uploads. Special thanks to our Patreon supporters, Nathan Martin and Future Collective. $1 a month helps me bring even more content to you guys and I even have some exclusive content coming, so check it out. Check the description below to find links to our pages on Instagram, Patreon, and more. Thanks for watching the video and ride on, Coaster Maniacs.